I'm Dr. Douglas Maple. I'm a pulmonologist and critical care specialist here at Flagstaff Medical Center. And this is Suzanne Taggett, our CME program director. And this is Aaron Blazik, who's our master of AV materials here in Flagstaff. And we're here to thank you for the kind award for our CME program. Uh, we'd like to thank all the people at F F FMC and VVMC who make our CME program a success. In particular, the individuals who serve on our CME uh, committee in this collage picture uh, you see here. Our CME committee donate their time to make sure that our programs meet the needs of our providers. They follow the rules for uh, providing unbiased content, and they also provide direct feedback to our uh, CME contributors. Our contributors provided 4,364 hours of CME content over the last three years in uh, topics ranging from trauma education, which is big here since this is a, a major trauma center, our annual cardiology conference, and also Native American health conferences that we do in collaboration with our regional IHS hospitals. And then recent topics such as physician bog burnout, which is uh, currently very popular, and issues in wilderness medicine or such as what happens if you decide to go up to the Grand Canyon and run from rim to rim to rim in hot weather. We'd uh, like to thank ARMA for its excellent leadership, particularly Terry Harnish and Dr. Charlie Dashbach for educating us on how this is done and keeping us organized and on task. We'd especially like to thank the reviewers who made the trip to Flagstaff last year to meet with our committee and do our site review and give us feedback on how we are doing. Moving forward, we're looking forward to ways that we can continue to provide quality CMA hours. As you know, uh, physicians appreciate high quality, low cost and easy access to CME, and particularly programs that support our practices and help us uh, stay up to date on uh, we can, what we can do to do a better job of taking care of patients. You may also know that physicians resent um, the expensive uh, maintenance of certification programs that are demanded by the American Board of Medical Specialties, which is essentially a racketeering operation that's trying to take over CME, uh, force us to study topics that have no application to our patients, and uh, suit any, uh, nobody but themselves. So we want to make sure that we keep our system of providing excellent CME for the benefit of our providers and our patients here in Arizona so moving forward. Uh, thanks again to Suzanne Tackett, our master of CME uh, and an excellent uh, leader for our group. And thanks again to you, Aaron, for all your CME uh, uh, AV efforts. And uh, God bless you and happy trails to you.